So we're in Washington, just north of Seattle. And it looks like Cabela's is requiring us to wear a mask. Let's see what happens. So we're in Washington, and there's a few people that aren't willing to wear their mask. Of course, we're not. And we're in Cabela's. I don't know. I think the reason why they get away with what they do is because people will comply. Oh no, there's a little girl that has her mask on. Two of them. Terrible. Um, anyway, no one, no one here in the store has said anything to us whatsoever at all. We walked in and we've walked by, I don't know, 10 or 12 different employees. No one said anything to us. I don't know that they will or not, but again, I think the reason why they get away with it, what they get away with is because people are willing to comply. And the best way to take a tyrant's power away is by not complying to him. So, anyway, nice store, Cabela. Too bad you didn't care about freedom. Or maybe you do, but you're just afraid to lose your license. No problem. He's right, he's right in the middle of the transaction. Good, how are you doing? Is that it? That's it. Just a t-shirt. Veteran or military? Nope. Okay. 1961? The one. Military veteran? No. No, no, no. There you are. Thank you. Yeah. You too. So, like I said, we went in there, we didn't wear a mask, we didn't make an issue, we got what we wanted, walked around the store, pretty neat, pretty cool store, and uh, we went to the cashier and bought it, we never had a mask, really no one ever even gave us any trouble at all, nobody, customers or, or the staff, we walked past probably at least 20 to 25 staff right by them and they never said a word to us. And again, I believe that they only get away with it. I'm talking about Governor Inslee and his unconstitutional, unlawful lawful orders. They only get away with it because we comply. So, thank you.